How's it going, everyone? Dry FIFA here. Welcome back to episode number four from Manchester United Grand Mode on FIFA 16 season two. And of course, guys, as you can see, we're playing the Community Shield against, of course, Arsenal. And you can see it's not the greatest day to be playing any football because, as you can see, it's absolutely pouring down. Look at the white in the Manchester United logo. They're absolutely fantastic visual. Uh, but nevertheless, we're down to it. As you can see, we brought in the man himself, the legend. Zlatan Ibovic, who gets the number nine shirt. Obviously, I went in to make some changes as well. As you can see, Anthony Marshall, the man uh, who previously had the number nine, is wearing the number 11, just like he is in real life. Uh, but nevertheless, we have we brought in some players that can definitely cause some damage, ship some players out. We're looking to probably make a few more signs as well, so stay tuned for that. Zlatan in the front, Marshall in behind, Fellaini and uh, Snadalini in midfield, as you can see there, Mkhitaryan, the new signing on the wings, as well as, of course, Memphis Depay. So, uh, a lot of pace, very strong in midfield, maybe not the best to be playing Fellaini and Snadlin, but nevertheless, we want it with, with Arsenal and the pace they have, we want to be a little bit more defensive in midfield and try to see if we can push it out to the flanks and, um, you know, get it to Zlatan. All right. I think I'm going to go ahead and switch the play here. All right, go for it. Uh, bit too tame there. Wanted to test the keeper. Ah, oh, come on. Ah, how did you lose that out? Small ends a bit too fragile there. All right, it's going to spin. Ah, come on, man. What is Flynn doing there? He's like he's just standing. Bit too slow. There. I know the water, the rain doesn't help us at all either. Man. That was a really good save there from De Gea. Gonna be in the first goal of the game. That was pretty good. All right, out wide. All right, Mkhitaryan, now so you can cut back inside. All right, push into the box. All right, go for it. Ah, what a block. That's a good block there. It's <laughs> definitely a good block. So I'm gonna go with a uh, in swinger, uh, kind of from the out, swinging in, so you can get a head onto it. Nice. Ooh, what a block off the line. Make a turn. Ah, uh, look, there we go. All right, Memphis. I right, cross it in. Ooh, yes. And it's the man himself, the myth, Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Let's see here. So he was, he was onside. That's good for Memphis. They're staying onside. And look at that finish from Zlatan. Absolutely no chance for the keeper. Look at that near post. And of course, he puts it high up into the, the net. Into the roof of the net, no chance for the keeper there. Absolutely cracking goal. What a start! All right, come on, nice. Mm. I love how Shaw is playing, he's so nifty on the ball. All right, go for it. Ah, it's a nice block there. All right, come on. All right, guys, so as you can see, a uh, very interesting game so far. Five shots, four on target for 62% of the ball. We we're completely dominating the game. Uh, pretty close in pass accuracy, but look at our shot accuracy, 80% as well. So again, we we're dominating. They had one chance, really, to save, but... All right. Let's see, make sure we don't want to let, back, let them back into the game. So we need to try and see if we can get another goal. Oh, look at it there. He's outside, isn't he? Oh, he's not outside. Okay. Look, open. Ah, just got the ball out there. Good defending. Didn't even get a chance to try and switch it out. I believe that was Memphis. I was trying to play to Memphis, but I didn't even get a chance to even touch it out there. So that was really good defending from them there. They're around me on me in an instant. Nice. All right, go for it. Ah, oh, another good defense. And that is it, guys. That is it. We hold on with a 1-0 win. Uh, it was a very difficult game because of the simple fact that it was raining so much. It was, it, the passes just wasn't coming off. I'm surprised we even did so well in the first half. I'll be surprised to see what the stats are in the second half because it seemed like the rain started raining a lot harder and made it even more difficult for us to get strings and passes together. It was absolutely crap. I mean, I don't know how... EA made it so bad. I mean, I know the rain makes it difficult, but it shouldn't be this difficult in the rain. It's absolutely ridiculous, in my opinion. All right, guys. So as you can see, uh, still not much from them in the second half. They definitely made it difficult for us in the second half, especially the rain didn't help. Still two shots, one on target. We had eight, seven on target. Pretty close in position, as you can see there. Uh, you can see our pass accuracy. It definitely dropped from the 80% it was to the 72 and the shot you can see there at the 87% to the 50%. 
I'm just really happy that uh, Zlatan got us that goal and uh, we were able to get that trophy. All right, so we have finally, finally got our super number one target that we wanted. And of course, guys, we're going to go ahead and accept this. Get this one dusted, wrapped up, and tied, sealed, and delivered to Manchester. And of course, that means the former player himself, we all know, Paul Pogba is heading back to Manchester United. That's what we wanted. Uh, nothing else new here. Let's go ahead and see who this player is. And that is Luke Shaw. And he's wanting some uh, bumper on his wages. Hmm. All right, so we've got some transfers here. Let's go ahead and definitely deny these. So we can get 26.2. They are tripping. So let's go ahead and reject that. No future. We're not selling them these for the future. Uh, as far as Fellini go, we'll hold off. We'll go ahead and just reject this for now. If someone coming to I bid, we probably might sell them. You just never know. But for now, we'll hold off on that. Uh, let me go and look for Luch. Uh, still not willing to accept. He is absolutely bugging right now. So we're going to have to go in and see what's going on there. All right, guys. So we're going into our next game, which is going to be, of course, at Old Trafford at home against, of course, the Mighty Spurs. Now, this is going to be an interesting one because I'm sure Spurs is going to be up for this one as well. Not quite sure how good they have done in the transfer market so well, but we should definitely be getting a win here. So hopefully that happens. All right, guys. So we're going to 4-4-1-1 four, four, one, one formation. As you guys may already know, uh, Imabrich, Wamata in behind, Depay, Pogba. The snoo snarling, uh, signing, Snyder and Marshall. I couldn't get no one there out there, which is absolutely crazy. Uh, but nevertheless, we kind of shipped Marshall out to the wind just to see uh, a little more pace as well. Out of place, a bit tired, which is surprising. And of course, you can see they're going with a 4 2 3 1 formation. Kane up front definitely need to be careful for him and Lamala as well. Uh, they're very, very good. All right, out wide. Come on, run on to that. Right, Marshall, let's see what you can do. All right, go for it. Oh, I thought I was just going to curl in. Uh, seems like we're being a bit off the pace. I'm not quite sure what is going on because they've definitely played Marshall in the wings. It just seems to not be coming off. Look how close that was, though. Ah, uh, this is not good. They're just bulleting forward. Oh, he absolutely done me. Absolutely done me. Ooh. Nice out wide. There we go. All right, so I'm going to cut this back in. All right, go for it. Oh, my God. What is going on, man? We have been hitting the crossbar. Or we're just going just inches away from going in. What is going on? We're so off today. Ah, absolute dummy again. This is not good. That's a goal. And in the 32nd minute at home. We are losing to Tottenham, which is not good. I'm sure the fans are not going to be happy right now. Bad goal to concede too as well. All right, there we go. What a pass. All right, cut it back. There we go. All right, go for it. Ah, look at that, man. That would have been a goal last season. What is going on, man? It's just like players, they're just so off. What is going on? Oh. Thank God he didn't call for a foul. I thought it was going to be a penalty. I'm so happy that's not. All right, let's push forward here. All right, come on, Shaw. All right, go for it. Oh, off the crossbar again. That's what's been happening, guys, this whole game. All right, control it. All right, let's see if we can push forward in a quick counter here. I know we need to get something going, man. Oh, nice. Ref, thank you very much for not calling. Oh, nice. All right, one matter. Go for it. Yes! Yes, in the diamonds of the game. And Wamata has saved us, guys. Save us at least a point where we're going to be picking up. Uh, you can see it's just one minute of extra time, which means we probably don't have any more minutes to try and get anything out of this game. So that was absolutely crucial that we didn't lose this game. But at the same time, we should be winning this game. I'm a bit frustrated, to be honest. I really am. With all the power players that we have in the squad, Zlatan Ivovic, he has hit the post and of course the, the worst part is too it's probably not even going to show up on the stats because once it hits the post it does register as being a target which is really frustrating but geez man i knew it was going to go i knew i wasn't going to get a chance man once the ball kick off 
the whistle was going to go and they spread it wide too as well they were kind of playing for the draw they thought they were probably going to win once they conceded they just started holding the ball of trying to go out wide it's frustrating all right guys so as you can see a very poor game one shot to them one on target and they scored we had six attempts and to be honest about four of those or three three or four of those came off the crossbar all right we have one that hit the post and two that came off the crossbar absolutely drive me bonkers to be honest that that happened um i don't even know what to say look at the pass accuracy pretty close as you can see but look at the shot accuracy 16 percent. that is absolutely awful we had some really good attempt as you guys saw uh coming from luke shaw and so forth and they just completely just went inches away from going in normally those are goals especially the one from memphis which is in, pretty much in the box and it just went wide i don't know what was happening today it was a frustrating game i'm just glad we didn't look all right so let's go ahead and take a look into our emails see what's going on here definitely not selling him let's go ahead and reject this all future offers as well and especially we can get a lot more for them too as well they are bugging and they have the money to spend too as well all right guys so that is going to be it for this episode as you can see we're going to be facing off of course against byron 04 i believe chikorito plays for this team so he's going to be definitely up for this one as well nevertheless it's a match that we definitely another trophy we're definitely looking to pick up uh, which we definitely want to so stay tuned to see what happens if you guys enjoy the show leave a like subscribe share and we'll see you guys in the next episode peace